Hello, hello everybody, and welcome back to more Yu-Gi-Oh! It's me, Cooper, and today we're going to be taking on Arcana's army. But in order to do so, we need to make one of our own. So I'm going to bring out our weakest members, the people with the lowest levels. Hmm. Oh, Bakora for sure. Bakora needs edits. Holy crap, does he need edits. Okay, um... You know what? This guy's cool and all, but he's done. We don't need him. Alright, you don't need him. Not in your life. Um... Let's see who else we have on on deck. Who have we not used in a bit? Who would suit your army's needs? Felicity? You know, he's not, he's not the worst, you know? He's not the worst guy to have around. You know, you like warriors. Robotic Knight, okay. Ooh, Panther Warrior. That's a real monster. All right, you're getting Panther Warrior. I feel like this would suit his army quite well. And Panther Warrior is going to be one of your heaviest hitters. And this guy is going to get your healers, uh, healing stuff. There we go. Now, Panther Warrior, out of curiosity, what are you good at? Swift Panther Slash, Field Adept. Okay, we have Field, Castle, and Knight. So we have three different buffs, and honestly, I'm liking this so far. Um, I think this team looks pretty good. So, Esperoba, you're a new guy. Let's check you out. Green Circle. You have Road Adept, Wasteland Adept, No Adept, and Road Adept. Okay. Jinzo is pretty cool. Psychic Wave. Uh, oh, no, we're not getting rid of Jinzo. I just wanted to know. Psychic Wave, Left Arm Cannon, Machinery Cutter. Um, you guys holding any items I need to know about? No, no, no. Well, I'm not going to let... Cybersaurus is technically a machine. You like machines, do you? Mm. You know, I'm going to bring... Oh, Espero is level 35? Holy crap, he doesn't even need to come. Um, people that need to come are level 16s, and Mai's too strong. Uh, Tristan's level 18, no. Honestly, I just kind of want to use Esperola because he's new. I, I, I mean, he's level 35 for, like, no re- Why is he so high level? Like, I get that his monsters don't have anything. Like, they don't have any items or anything, so I, I can't buff them. But, like, damn, he's still strong. All right, they get blue medicines, and none of these guys care about dark energy. They, they're road road abilities. Interesting. Uh, maybe I should take one out. Honestly, like, no, their stats are not terrible. They're not the they're not very great. But he's just I just don't have any items to buff him. That's the problem. All right, whatever. Let's just do this mission. It's gonna be a really interesting one. A lost cause, taking down freaking um, Arcana. Now, Arcana, let's see what you got. I'm going to bring in a whole cool-looking army, and we're going to make them scare you, hopefully. I hope. There he is. It looks like you're not the only one that can master the Dark Magician, Yugi. Why don't we determine who's true master? Who's the true master? Well, I mean, we both have different... We could have different Dark Magicians. Ooh, there's water on this field. Too bad I didn't bring... Uh, oh, I didn't bring Mako Tsunami, because he would have actually had fun here. Alright, Yugi, apparently you're getting called out, so I should let you go. Fizdiz, I want you to capture the far-off land. I don't even think there's a roaming monster. You get somebody here, but there's no roaming monster, so just ignore them. Bakora needs experience, so Bakora, you're going to enter this part of the map. Esperoba, we kind of want to see you fight, so I'm going to let you stay here and defend base. So, Taya and Simon need experience. Simon, I'm going to let you go over here. And then, Taya, I want you to go mid. And then let's see what kind of army Arcana's got. He's got people hiding in the woods. Ooh, okay, lots of spellcasters, got it. Uh, the second Yugi gets here, they're going to start going towards Yugi, so we got to be ready for that. I'll have you. Yeah, see, look at that, they just changed directions, okay. We're going to have you get ready to defend Yugi. Now, I don't want you to fight them all, but I do want you to fight them. And Taya... Try to cut them off and try to cut half of them. And then we have good old... Wow, Ansatsu so fast. Holy crap. You guys were not kidding. Look how fast... Look at him! Holy crap. Why is he so fast? Who thought that was a good idea? All right. So they're almost to Yugi. I'm cutting off their troops right now. Ansatsu's on his way. He'll cut in through half. Teya's going to get through half. Um, and you, Simon, you're going to get through half. 
So he's get okay, he got to Yugi. That was not my plan. But him getting into Yugi is fine. We'll just get to give Yugi some training. He hasn't fought in a while. Yeah. Oh no, Simon. Oh wow, Simon did get him. Okay, cool. This is what we wanted. Light arrow. Let's see how much that can do to us. Does this count as the road or where, where are we? Aqua pressure. Okay, Aqua Midor. So this person has two Gemini elves. That's pretty impressive. Getting both of them. And that one's guarding in the middle. So let's see. Items? No, but they're high level. The one in the middle especially. So first things first. Let's uh, Violet Crystal. I don't think there are any of them are dark at night adept or whatever. Yeah, look at that. Our troops are getting stronger. And then B Gilfer Flame, the one of the Gemini Elves, in case they have a special ability. I'm pretty sure they do. And then you for sure just obliterate her with your magic cannon. We've been training Dark Elf. We want her to be powerful. Ooh, nice, nice. Good damage. And Gemini Double Radiation! Oh, crap! Special ability activate! Oh, that's their special attack that's going to hurt. That's going to hurt. It hits the whole team. We got critted. We have 98 HP left. I don't even have enough to heal. I don't even think I can keep her alive, but I have to try. Holy shit. That Gemini shit hurts. I wish I would have killed them instead of healing. If they do that again, we're done. I hope one of my monsters get an attack off. Oh, thank God. Dark Elf, finish off Gemini Elf so they can't do that again. Magic Cannon! Yeah, that, that was a problem. That that was actually an issue. Our team is really suffering from that. Um, we're still tanky enough to finish them off. Luckily, they don't, they used up a lot of action points to make that happen, but still sucky. Sucky situation. Oh, she was guarding still. Damn, Magic Ray. Okay, let's see how much that does. Of course, they're going after my weakest member right now. That's just rude. Okay, they missed. Good. They can't... Oh, they would have got two attacks off. If that one didn't miss, I would have died. Holy crap. I got lucky. I got very lucky. All right. Well, this was uh, this was a learning experience for sure. This was for sure a learning experience. We're just going to cut them down and then think about where we're going to put Simon because Simon's not in uh, fighting shape anymore. I'm glad I got him experience. That was always the plan. I'm just a little worried about him. Beast of Gilfer, you can finish off that one. All that's left is a tiny little Aquamador. I'm glad that this guy did not get to Yugi. Yugi's health is important to me. 300 damage. Very nice. Let's see how much Magic Cannon can do. She's underleveled, so I would understand if it doesn't do as much. No, it did even more. <laughs> Holy shit. And you get to do it twice because the game said so. Alright, Magic Cannon number two. We have a turn for healing, luckily, so let's give her... Give her a nice heal. Wow, this was uh, this has been a weird mission already. We just started and some shit has happened. Apparently, the forces they are sending out are decently strong. All right, we've won. Dark Elf, come on, get to fifteen. Yeah, fifteen. Simon got to seventeen. Makes that makes me happy. I might need to pull him back a little bit. He's been uh, <laughs> he's been a little bit injured. Um, where is he? No, fall, fall back. No, no, no. Don't go towards the enemy. Run away from them. Let Ansatsu, let, let Taya freaking and the other person fight them. All right. I don't know much about these guys. Let's find out. Oh, shit. They're night adept. Level four magic. He has the ability of level four magic. He has no items. Okay. But he's allowed to use level four magic. Okay. That's pretty scary. Um, I can't use my violet crystals here. There are too many night adepts. So I'm forced to heal. That Dark Elf is my first target. This is, uh, this is bad. Simon taking on that first enemy was very good. That was exactly what we needed to do to save Yugi. But this enemy is going to put Simon a little too low. Ah, uh, shit. Perplex Hex. Okay, luckily most of these characters are tanks and not very strong. It's just the Dark Elf I'm worried about. Well, the fact that that guy can use level 4 magic and he just doesn't have an item it makes me very lucky. <laughs> if he actually had an item, we'd be screwed. Alright, our Dark Elf can do 269, not as much as I had hoped. That's without the buff of my, my Violet Crystals. Alright, Gilfer Flame, we expect a lot from you as well. 
Yeah, it could be better. 276. Okay, let's see. 269 is how much we did. How much do you do back to us? 277. You're stronger than us. She, they have a stronger Dark Elf than ours. Our Dark Elf's only level 15. Ultimate Unity! Oh, Beast of Gilfer is... Yeah, they're not going to make it, are they? They're at 500. Yeah, they're not going too good. The best we could do is try killing off the Dark Elf before it gets any more attacks off on Beast of Gilfer. It just might not work out. We just need a few more hits. Just a few more hits. That's all we're looking for. Oh, shit. Uh, oh, she's aiming at our other Dark Elf. Okay, that might be better. Yeah, that, that, that'll be fine. Holy shit, it won't. It won't. It's not. It's not okay. It's not okay. We're almost dead. We're about to die. Are we dead? Are we actually dead? Did we lose Dark Elf? The one that we're trying to train for crying out loud? Oh my god, she's so low. And he has no healing items. Oh yeah, that's just great. That's just great. He needs a crit. Kill off their Dark Elf before they get an attack. Please. We don't have any healing items on you. Oh, I do have a healing item on you. And I'm going to use the healing item. I want I want to kill off the Dark Elf. But at the same time, I feel like if I go for the kill, the other guy will perplex, hex her, and kill her. Oh, good. Okay, good. She got an attack off. Stop her from getting her final attack. All right. All right. It's not going too good, but it's not that bad either. We're doing okay. Simon has done worse. This is, this is doable. Perplex Hex is coming in. I was right about him attacking her. And she survives. Okay, now we just need to break down this guy. Get rid of them level 4 magic users. No need for them. That's a pretty strong ability you guys got there. What, uh, what crazy person allowed you to have this kind of magic power? And in fact, guys, reading those abilities is a good tip. Because um, it sets you up for the final boss of this area. And what that final boss will be doing to you. So, for the love of God, do not... T like, you can see that level 4 magic? Do not take it lightly. You're going to face it. Alright, get, 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 get... No! Damn it! I wanted him to run away, not run towards. Oh, this circle's too big. Beast of Gilfer takes up too much space. Alright, let's just kill off the perplexed Hexer. Who's that in the background? Do you guys see someone in the background over there? They're, like, flying up and down? I swear, I saw somebody. Look at, look in the background. You see him? Top left of the screen. What is that? What is that? Looks like an insect of some sort. I honest to God can't tell you what it is. I don't know. It's too far away for me to tell. I'm so curious. I'm perplexed. <laughs> I am actually perplexed on this situation. What's going on here? All right, Tal the Chanter, you just keep guarding. I don't want to fight you anyway. I want to kill off your illusionist faceless mage, this tanky guy. All right, he's dead. Most of my monsters are near death. Hey, he did keep guarding. Perfect. All right, and since he kept guarding, we can just wait him out. That's enough waiting for me. I'm going in. This guy's not going to be that tanky anyway. His stats as a monster are very low. So after this fight, hopefully I could just abandon ship, because I, I think Simon's got enough levels for the day. Um, if I need him later in the day, I will heal him, but for now he needs to fall back. There we go. 53 HP left. Easy kill. I wonder what that bug is. Somebody in the comments, tell me what that bug is, and what does it mean? I never see any, like, animals in the background. Uh, one time I think I did. Hmm. What does it mean? There's just like a creature over there. And I just don't know what it is. Run. No. Oh, shit, shit, shit. Get out. No, no. Let me get him out. Ah, oh, Taya. God damn it. I mean, I'm happy, but thank... Damn it. All right. Let's see. Taya's taking on some really dark monsters that are really strong for some reason. Holy crap. They're all very powerful monsters. I get that. Okay. I really do. But, I mean, the two uh, the two skulls, I'm, uh, they're just there for, like, buffing. At least on my team. Let's see. They're not on their team. Okay. Hmm. Spellcasters and fiends. Let's see how you handle the power of nature. Ha ha ha. This is Taya's ace in the hole. Making all of my monsters very powerful. Suijin, let's deal with that spectral bastard. 
Yeah, the illusionary gentleman needs to be dealt with. That's a that's a monster I gave to Bakora. And Thunderbolt. There we go. He's got Spectral Mist again. Kind of a dick, but what are you going to do? Dark Witch can take it. She doesn't like it, but she can take it. And can you guys stop bullying Dark Witch? My god, they really don't like Dark Witch. You know, seriously, what the hell? Why are they... Are they all just targeting her? She's already down to five. She was at 1,600 for crying out loud. What the... Die! Alright, one more hit. One more. Good. Sui Jin, get a kill. There we go. Hydro Cannon. Or Raging Waters, which is a way better than name. We do have Blue Medicine if we need it, but for now we're just gonna... We're gonna start working on one of these buggers. It doesn't matter which one we kill. We just need to kill one. Oh, beautiful! Critical hit! Skull Spark, uh, still aiming at her. You dicks. You absolute dicks. Uh, stop it. I s I'm getting mad. I'm getting upset. You need to stop. Forcing me to blue medicine makes me very upset. Honestly, I'd prefer to red medicine, but whatever. The give Lang Sui Jin or Sangha get the killing blow. Alright, Sangha took out one of these skull enemies by himself. Two crits! Oh, he that Oh, it's because he's holding that item. Yeah, he's he's got him. Alright, we should have just red medicine, honestly, here. Just just take that. You're gonna need it. I put Tay in a dangerous position, so I want her near full. And then why don't you just do some big hits? And just let Sangha deal with it. That, that's fine. It's fine. He'll get a crit. It's all good. I forgot the item I got I got him, but it gives him crits, so we'll we'll just take those. And Taya wrecks her opponent. Suijin, Taya, Sangha, Dark Witch, yeah, everyone levels up. Heck yeah. We got Suijin to level 10. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. He's getting up there. I need them all at high levels. To make me feel stronger. Okay, give me time to get him the fuck out of here. Ugh, two enemies. Ansatsu didn't cut any of them off. Ansatsu hurry. All right, Yugi, I'm sorry. Luckily, these guys don't seem as strong as the other ones, but I'm sorry, Yugi. Hmm. Invitation to Sleep is their best monster, and it's only a defensive one. No Night Adepts. Okay. They're all Night Adept. Okay. Well, let's start cutting them down one by one. Um, They're all really, like, pretty weak. Let's just start with Phantom Duwan. I don't like this guy. Yeah, Phantom Duwan needs to die. Shadow Swoop! Uh-oh! Saggy the Dark Clown! He throws an energy ball at us. But he's a super weak monster, so I don't expect much from it. Yep, not even- uh, just barely a hundred. Spellbind! Yep, Phantom Duwan is a dick. Sorry about this, Celtic Guardian. And he got a crit! Unlucky! Okay. I mean, the crit didn't even do that much damage, but still unlucky. Murky Burning! It's like Saggy's attack, but faster and stronger. There we go. Sleep wave. I probably won't like that attack. All right. Hopefully, Dark Magician can take a sleep wave. Oh, yeah. He could take it. All right. Dark Magician. Uh, let's get rid of Saggy. I don't want to see him. If you can, murder him. Oh, don't let him dodge you. You're the Dark Magician for crying out loud. You can't let that happen. All right. Murky burning it is. Ooh, 320. Nice, nice, nice. Waiting. How dare you wait? Face death. You better not actually dodge it twice. Okay, good. Saggy's dead. That person's waiting now. They're just dead. They're just dead. Okay, so these enemy types were very weak. I got lucky. The ones that went first and got killed by my, my weaker soldiers, uh, they were the ones that could have actually hurt us. These guys, they're jokes. Sleep wave. I'm sad that you got off another attack, but it's still a joke. Alright, I put Taya in the same base as him. He'll heal up real nice. There we go. And one of these weird enemy crew crews have been killed. Yugi is strong. That's why he's my... Well, not my highest anymore. I was going to say he's my highest level guy. But the truth is, the highest level guy in my army is Esperoba at level 35. Because the game has just decided to give me a powerful Esperoba. Very strange, honestly. 
All right. Ansatsu's on his way. He's moving. His, his ass is moving, but he can't make it in time. All right. Let's just destroy these soldiers. They're not even worth anything. The ones we fought earlier, yeah, they were worth something. But these guys, nah. These guys are jokes. Yeah, cut them in half. One more attack and he's dead. Murky burning. And I don't mind if Yugi gets a lot of experience here. It's important to level up your Yugi's. Alright, so they're both guarding, which gives me some time to heal, but this is not my healing character, therefore he's going to guard. This is also not my healing character, therefore he's going to guard. This is my healing character, why don't you heal the Dark Magician, please? I guess I do not really put heals on these people. Alright, Shadow Swoop, let's see who's taking that Dark... Please don't hit Dark Magician Girl, the one person that didn't guard. Zero damage. Couldn't break my guard. All right. And now that you've let your guard down. Door. All right. Sleep wave. Let's see. Aim at Celtic Guardian. He's still guarding. Oh, I think he did? Or Dark Magician. No, he aimed at Celtic Guardian. And the guard was good. Murky birding. Don't let that saggy do anything else. Not bad. Well, this last guy is uh, pretty weak, so Yugi, go. <laughs> Use your power. And Yugi, go. Use your power. Beautiful. Well, that was easy. Yugi hits level 20. Heck yeah. Everyone else levels up except Dark Magician Girl. She did not. And that's fine. She'll get there. She'll get there. Celtic Guardian is well, now with my highest level monster, right? Level 31? I actually don't know who's the highest level, but that's pretty high level in my opinion. Alright, Tay, I just cut this guy off. This guy was not even a threat to you the first time around, so... I mean, granted, he bullied your Dark Witch, but she's fully healed, so you're fine. You're fine. Spectral Mist, nothing we need to worry about. Luckily, we're fighting all these enemies in the day. If uh, we wait too long and it's nighttime, we're in trouble. Because do not forget, this game does have a day and night cycle. Alright, power of nature, buff up all of my troops. Now they're going after Sangha. He could take hits. Yeah, if you want to attack Sangha, go right ahead. He really does not care about any of you. Sangha, while we're here, why don't you try and hit their boss monster? Yeah, make him suffer a little bit. Uh, with Sui Jin, you do the same thing. Beautiful. Then I'm gonna need... Oh, wait, hold up. Spectral Mist is coming in. Okay, he's aiming at Dark Witch now. That's not a problem for us. That just means our HP will be kept pretty high. Um, honestly, just... Th there's not that many enemies left, so just do another buff. I right, make it so our other two troops can kill them all. And these skull sparks don't matter, so it's fine. Having Taya, uh, Taya having her boss monster, the Dark Witch, is pretty nice. It's like, hey, remember Duelist Kingdom when Taya used this monster? Kind of? Maybe? Yeah? Okay. And there it goes. It's actually a pretty good buffer. And the fact that it's a flying unit helps out a lot. Flying units are pretty fast. Alright, no more mist to worry about. I might even get a Midgard Volt off instead of just powering myself up. Wow, you suck. <laughs> it's like, damn, you you really do suck. That's It's a shame. It's a shame that you were even brought to this battle. You should have wait, waited till nighttime. Why did you just charge us? You wait till nighttime, your troops might actually be a threat. You know, just stay in the castle. The castle gets well defended. You get some defenses up, you know? Pretty, pretty intimidating that way. And I forgot free crits. Yep, we get free crits with that character. And Suijin, is Suijin literally just a tablecloth? Like, this, Suijin is just a tablecloth that shoots water. But the, I, I never noticed that until this game. Because, like, in the in the show, in the show, when he gets fused with Gate Guardian, he's a solid creature. But here, it's like, nah, nah, he's just water. He's just a wet tablecloth. That's him. Alright, whatever. I'll take what I can get. Teo's getting some levels, which we desperately needed for Suijin. Yeah, that's pretty good. Getting her to level... Uh, you know who really needed levels was Bakora, but he wasn't fast enough to... I, I put him too far out. He couldn't cut them off. 
All right, Bakura, so I'm going to let you go fight the final boss. Not actually, I'm going to let him get near the final boss. I don't know about fighting the final boss. Uh, let's just check the map and see what the traders have to say. Book of Secret Arts. Ah, shit, where is she? I sent her way over there, didn't I? All right, well, I'm going to have you move way over here. Yep, all right, there, there's Fizdiz, isn't it? Yep, there's Fizdiz. Her discount would be very nice right about now. All right, let's see. No trader in this one. Fizdiz, go all the way over here. You know what? No, before I do that, screw it. Fizdiz, let me, uh, let me buy a trader. They're expensive, but we'll do it. Let's see what he sells. Red medicine. Okay. Well, that's something. All right. We could use a few more. All right. Fizdiz, we need Book of Secret Arts, which means we need you to give us a discount. And then I'm going to move everyone else to a proper position. Yugi, get all the way to the boss, because I'm going to want you to take him out. It's supposed to be Dark Magician versus Dark Magician. Taya, you defend base. You need some heals while we're here? Yeah, let's heal you up a little bit. There we go. Taya will defend base until Fizdiz gets there. Bakora, you will test the waters. I need you to... Yeah, your monsters are pretty strong. Yeah. Yeah! These are some pretty good monsters. Alright, test the waters. See what uh, Arcana's like. For Yugi, anyway. I am the true master of Dark Magician. Come fight me, Yugi, and see for yourself. It will be my pleasure to show you his limitless potential. And of course, he is talking about the Red Dark Magician, which is an amazing creature. Honestly, I really like the Red. It's my favorite Dark Magician is the Red one. <coughs> his white hair, everything. Oh yeah, he's got Regeki, by the way. Level 5 Magic, Magic Crafter, Knight Adept. Yeah. Yeah, he's, he's a level 5 magic user. He's a level 99 Dark Magician number 2. Yeah. And his Raigekis will wreck your team. So, kill him immediately. Although he has 2,300 stats. So, yeah, that's going to be a problem. Holy shit, is that going to be a problem? Raigeki! Alright, let's see how much it does. Need to figure this. Holy shit. <laughs> Holy shit. Okay. Oh, um, remember how I wanted to level up Bakora? I, um, I lied. I have a monster born, that's nice. Um, apparently I lied. Escape. Ah, it didn't work. Alright, well, I tried to escape. Raigeki, okay, well, we got two of his Raigekis, that's nice. And Bakora's dead. That's a level 99 mag Dark Magician. Sorry, Bakora. I know I wanted to level you up, um, but apparently Dark Magician's busted. And Raigeki's busted. Okay, so one troop is gone. That's that's sad. That's really sad. Uh, when Yugi ends up fighting that guy, we're going to kill him. So I'm going to need somebody to take that final Raigeki for me. And it's looking like the... Oh, shit. It's looking like Simon has a job to do. Hey, Simon. I need you to do Yugi. Eh, you're one of the main guys. Nah, let him do it. I need you to do Yugi a big favor. You need to go kill this guy. He's 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 proven to be a problem. Now, this is a really big map. This is way bigger than the ones we're used to. Yeah, Fizdis has not gotten any action, but she's here for shopping. She is here for shopping. Uh, Esperoba, let's take a look at what your character looks like. Let's just take a... Yeah, look at Jinzo. He's pretty cool. Yeah, you're level 35, but and you're level 30 Jinzo, but the other guy's level 99, and he's got some busted-ass cards. So, I don't know how about this. I mean, I could send in Yugi now, but I don't think Yugi is tanky enough to do this. Also, he doesn't really have any healing items. Also, I would like to buy some Book of Secret Arts to buff my monsters. Hmm. Decisions, decisions. Maybe if I kill time, the weakness, the problem is that he'll be able to revive his troops over time. And then they will become issues for us. Very big issues. All right. Just get over here, Simon. I'm, you're, you're, I'm, I'm sending you to your death. It's not, it's not a great idea. But I already lost Bakora, and Bakora desperately needs levels, so I feel really bad about that. Um, that double Raigeki was just a little overkill. 
I got very lucky he used double Raigeki, because that means he only has one left. Which means, hey, you only have to take one Raigeki. Um, but don't kill him, because we need items. Speaking of which, did she stop moving? Did I accidentally click on you? Go. Go, 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 go. Hurry up. Alright, you move in. We're not going to kill him. We just... Even if I have the chance to kill him, if, like, I'm doing really good. That level 99 Dark Magician is a kind of insane. But in order to be the master of Dark Magician, you need to realize that sacrifices are necessary. We sacrifice Bakora because he would obviously betray us in the future. Dark Magic attack... Oh, he gets a Hyper Beam? Oh, 500 damage. Holy shit. He gets a Hyper Beam. He has no buffing items, but he just does 500 damage. He's truly the master of Dark Magician. Arcana, you earned the rank. You know, I don't deserve the rank. You earned it. You are the true master. Okay. Before it's even her turn, she's about to die. But I don't really have time. Let's kill that Dark Magician so Yugi doesn't have to deal with Raigeki. Alright. Kill Dark Magician. Sorry about this. The Master of Dark Magician must not fight the Dark Magician. Beast of Gilfer, go! Alright, he's dropped to 700 HP or 795 HP. That's not too bad. Luckily, his two invitations to sleep on the sides, those are what the monsters are called, they're really weak. Like, they can't even finish off Dark Elf. They're going to make Dark Magician do it. Alright, Dark Elf's gone. That's it. Yeah, that's a big shame. I, I, You know what? I don't think I've ever had to use a sacrificial play in this Let's Play, but today's the day. Today's the day we sacrificial play. Bring back my Dark Elf. She is still helpful. Sleep Wave, don't you dare aim at her. Damn it, stop aiming at her. Leave her alone. She's just trying to kill the Dark Magician. It's not that bad. You know what? Screw killing him, guard. We'll kill him with the other two. Alright, he's really low now. He's not using his final Regeki. That's interesting. He's saving it for Yugi. But, I mean, saving it won't make a difference if you're dead. Get him! Yeah. Sleep wave, yep. Okay, let's see if you can break our guard. Granted, Dark Elf's guard is extremely weak since she only has 800, but they missed, so it didn't matter. What about this guy? Can he break our guard? Yep, he broke it. All right. Well, if it's already broken, we might as well try to kill him off. Die, Dark Magician number two. You're cool, but you need... Oh, four HP! Raigeki on the final turn! Come on! We were four HP from killing him! No! It can't go down like this! You gotta be kidding me! Oh, I lost Simon. I swear, we had him! Dark Elf, why did you level up from not doing... You literally just needed four more damage! And then we would have won! God damn it. Alright, well, I'm still waiting for my discount. Here, I'll do... I mean, might as well. We're freaking killing time anyway. Alright. Oh, she's already here. Oh, that was the freak... She was already here. Book of Secret Arts. I was looking at freaking Esperoba. What does Dragon Capture Dar do? Oh, that's pretty good. All right, that's enough of that. Yugi, fight him. He's out of Raigeki's. I've, I've literally abused him. I tried to let Bakora take him. Bakora couldn't do it. I tried to let Simon take him. Simon couldn't do it. But Yugi, the king of the ma uh, the master of the mas uh, dark magicians, he should be able to do it. He's also the master of the Egyptian gods. And this guy's respawning forces. Shit. Shit. Because he's respawning forces, we have to fight those forces first. We were just barely out of time. I, I moved right... I was just a little too slow because I got confused between Espero, who, uh, Esperoba and Fizdiz, not realizing Fizdiz had already made it. Luckily, they're only at half health, so they're not big threats, but still annoying. Still annoying that I'm going to lose some HP on my, on my main squad just because they started respawning at the perfect moment. I did not kill them one after another, though. I, get, I think I had like a five-second gap between killing them. 
which might give me just enough time. Did I miss? Oh, come on! All right. Let Dark Magician do it. If he wants to die by Dark Magician's hand, then he gets to. Dark Magician girl, don't miss this attack. Come on. You already missed once. You're not allowed to miss twice. There you go. Let's see, that's some damage. Now he's guarding. All right, screw it. If they're guarding, they're, you can break it. Yeah, what they... Oh, my God. They have, like, 900 defense. It's not even funny. They're so weak. Yep, broke his guard. And Celtic Guardian will break his back. There we go. So whatever forces were trying to be revived in these freaking places, they're, they're dead now. Let Yugi fight the Dark Magician Master. I brought Dark Magician Girl with me. That'll show you that I'm the true master. Hell, he used Dark Magician Girl to defeat Arcana in the show. Okay, let's see. Blue Medicine up. There we go. Oh, look, that guy. Oh, two people got revived. And no one's there now. Haha, <laughs> you let them leave. You're all alone. Oh, wait. Oh, wow. Someone just respawned, but they were, like, outside of the base, so it's fine. All right, Arcana. Time for a true fight of Dark Magicians. Oh, wait. You're Dark... Wait, it, it healed? Oh, you have healing on your base. You only have... Se you have 74 HP already. Goodbye. All right. One less thing to worry about. Yeah. And a little bit of sleep wave. We really don't care about these attacks. Like, your two opposites should have been cooler spellcasters. Invitation to sleep? Maybe you can have one. They're cool enough, but they're really weak. They, don't, they have, like, 1,800 defense. They're a five-star monster. 1,500 attack. It's just terrible. And yes, I know many old Yu-Gi-Oh cards are just awful, but, like, come on. Not even 1,800 attack. It's 15... It's flipped? 1,500 attack? I mean, come on. Get out of here. No one wants you. And Arcana, your wipe has... Uh, you, you've been wiped. Goodbye. Celtic... Oh, you missed! How? I saw the sword hit him. I literally saw the sword hit him. If they want me to miss, they should make the attack actually miss. All right, there we go. 550 and murky burning sadly she doesn't do as much damage because she doesn't have any book of secret arts until now now that i bought some she'll actually get a lot stronger and celtic guardian don't miss there you go there we go arcana the master of the dark magician number two has been defeated which means that we can now obtain it yugi's level 21 dark magician girls level 32 and dark magician's level 26 celtic guardian 34 is really really high like, it's too high. Way more than we need. Yeah, this can't be happening. Not to me. My body, it's fading. I'm fading away. How could Scott do that to one of his own characters? He's merciless. Y Yugi, I think you'd be willing to do that. Yeah, baby. Red Dark Magician is joining the army. It's the coolest one. Honestly, his attack is cooler than Dark Magician's because it's just an energy beam. It's so cool. Secret power will be our next mission, everybody. Let's get some back. Oh, way in the in the corner. The Black Chaos Ruins. The ruins in the Dark Forest, once home to the Dark Magician, are said to hide powerful magic. Yugi sends most of his army to attack the capital, but takes a small group to search the ruins for this magic. There have been many treasure hunters th that have searched the Black Chaos Ruins for the secret treasures of the Lost Magic Kingdom, but none have ever lived to tell about it. Will Yugi be able to find this power that's been lost for so long and make it back to his friends? Interesting. We're going to try and find a secret power. But that's going to be it for this one. I want to thank you all for watching. If you're enjoying this series, please remember to like and subscribe. And next episode, we're going to find some interesting stuff. Bye bye